Bill Hart is a passionate man. He needs to be as he embarks on an ambitious project to collect 100 guitars that have all been played at Liverpool's famous Cavern Club. He wants them for an exhibition celebrating 50 years of the Mersey Sound, epitomised by the Beatles. And so far he's had a positive response. You know, it's been fantastic to see the responses, particularly in uh, the people uh, who live in Liverpool who, or who have lived in Liverpool and were touched by all this phenomenon of Mersey sound and Mersey beat that went on 50 years ago. Hart already has one very special guitar for his exhibition. It was played by Paul McCartney backstage at the Cavern. Oh, am I so lucky to have such a guitar like that. Now he didn't actually play it on stage, but he played it in the dressing room and he signed it and that's enough. It's been played in the Cavern. But it's not just the famous guitars and famous names. Hart also wants to get ordinary people involved in the project. I want to open up the Cavern Club on a particular date to be organised, to to, for people to bring along their guitars, strum a few chords, even if they can't play it doesn't matter, strum a few chords, take a photograph, and then that guitar, that ukulele, will have been played in the Cavern Club. The exhibition's location is still to be decided, but the Beatles story at Liverpool's Albert Dock is one possibility. Oh, I think it's a fantastic idea. If it's going to be pulled off, it can be pulled off in Liverpool. I can't see this occurring elsewhere. Um, there's something special about the fact, you know, Mersey Beat, 50 years of Mersey Beat, um, over 50 years of the cavern now, tying both ideas in. Um, and if you're going to get a generous response from people, it, it's going to be the Liverpoolian people. I've got enough drive and inspiration and um, uh, excitement about life mm. that this is the kind of thing I want to do. It just fires me up no end, I can tell you. Bill Hart needs to amass another 85 guitars for the Mersey Soundwave project within the next 18 months to two years. It's a difficult task, but with his passion and the passion of the Liverpool people, he has every chance of pulling it off.